Hello trumpet enthusiasts and early music nerds. Yesterday I showed you a little hack for your modern trumpet, how to turn it into a natural trumpet in D, like you lengthen all the slides and push down the three valves. But I used a Baroque beginner mouthpiece from BFB. Today I'm showing it to you with a modern trumpet mouthpiece with a Winston Bach one and a quarter C with a 24-25 backbone, which, we, which is actually what I used for my modern trumpet studies. And then, yeah, I'm gonna say a few things about it. So to make it short, it is in a way harder or more difficult to play on a modern mouthpiece, which is uh, logical, because this is designed to do a very different thing than a natural trumpet mouthpiece. First, as well, it has, I mean, the hole in this mouthpiece is quite a bit smaller than the one on the, the BFB mouthpiece. So I feel more back pressure, but that's just me, because I'm used to have something that has a bit of bigger hole. Um, as well, of course, it sounds a kind of a bit squeaky, because the, the cup is just too small for the amount of tubing that follows it. Usually the cup is in a proportion with the tube, or with the, with the volume of the tube. So there is a... There is a proportion between those two values and that makes the sound a bit squeaky and makes it also more difficult of course to lip the 11th overtone into a, into the spot where it sounds like an F so that's the differences but just to try it out of course uh, it works on the other side as well the instrument is of course not designed to do that I mean as soon as you pull out a slide, you always have gaps where you have a bigger mensur than where you don't have it, which affects, of course, the airflow in the instrument. Every time you have a, a, an edge, it creates a little turbulence behind the edge, which, which makes it much harder to, to feel the instrument. And that is also one of the differences to, to a, a real natural trumpet, which has, of course, uh, much less uh, interferences in the tubing. So, uh, yeah, that's the big difference. I hope uh, this clarified a bit uh, some questions that you might have about the last video. And, yeah, try it to find out how it feels. And if you like it, uh, Go for it. Have a good time and see you another time. Bye-bye.